So it is the inflation that you are not supposed to see. Toilet paper, yogurt, corn chips, everything that you can think of. Manufacturers are quietly shrinking package sizes without lowering the prices. And Marvin, I noticed this the other day. I bought a bag of corn chips and I looked at them and thought, is, is that smaller? And, lots of and it was. <laughs> they're, they're calling it shrinkflation and it's happening worldwide. For example, in the U.S., a small box of Kleenex now has 60 tissues. A few months ago, had 65. Experts say shrinkflation isn't really new, but it increases in times of high inflation as companies try to deal with the rising costs for ingredients, package, labor, and, of course, transportation. If you find your product has downsized, see if a competitor maybe hasn't changed yet. Try a store brand. Store brands usually are the last ones to downsize. Edward Dworsky, the consumer advocate, says to use unit pricing. That's the price on the shelf that tells you the price per ounce of a product. That way you can easily, you know, determine one brand or another, which size, you know, works out best for you.